All right, guys, welcome, welcome back to the channel. I got myself and baby Abe. And of course, this video, as you can tell from the caption on the thumbnail, we'll be showing you how we did a DIY project. And that DIY project was building movie posters with the LED light. So pretty much it's a LED light box, movie poster type vid. And I'll leave you with all the details in the description, pretty much all the wood that I used, how much it was approximately, the posters, the frame. And this is a alternative to per actually purchasing these things I already built, which can get pretty, pretty expensive. Upwards of, I don't know, 700 bucks. So it's maybe like 150, 300 bucks. It depends on where you shop, um, but I'm going to show you how I did this DIY thing. Hope you guys enjoy. Be sure to like, comment, leave all those thoughts below, and subscribe to my videos. I got some videos coming. Next video I got, I got my baby Abe. We doing potty training, so I want y'all to check that out also. So stay tuned, and here we go. So as you can see, I got the Coming to America poster. The frame itself, like I say, was 20 bucks. Got it from Walmart. Uh, the actual poster, I got it online, 10 bucks. So right there, I'm already in the whole 30 bucks on this poster here. That's a lot cheaper than 300 and something bucks if you go online. But I mean, you can go online and look at all the different prices and all the different types, but it's pretty much the same. I guess it comes out as the uh, same result. So just check it out here. Sorry, I was resting on my wife's car. She probably gonna be pissed when I do this. But you can do this all type of ways, however you want to. But I'm gonna show you my way and how I did it and, and how I felt it should be done on a budget. So check it out. So I made, I put some hinges on this puppy. So, when that time comes, I think I put three, three hinges. Three hinges on here. So when the time comes, I want to change this old poster out and maybe do a different thing. Because right now, it's Black History Month, so I'm doing everything Black History type deal. So all the movie posters that I do have, I got Juice, I got Friday, and I got Coming to America, and I got Bad Boys 2 poster coming. So like I said, um, it's Black History Month, so I'm showing my, my Black pride, if you will, or Black History Heritage, all that good stuff. But <clears throat> anyways, so I got these LED lights here. So this is about a 16 foot LED and it comes with an adhesive back on it. So the LED cost me like 13 bucks on Amazon. I'll leave the link down in the description. I use this tape here. This is actually, this is like insulation tape when you're doing ducking like duck, duck work, as far as like HVAC type stuff. This is just a aluminum foil type tape deal. And I got this huge roll for like maybe 50 bucks. And it should handle all four of my posters, or all of my uh, poster enclosures. And of course I got the wood here. Let me show you, let me bring it over here. So I got my wood here. Posters and your frames that would determine how much wood you would need. But for my 27 by 40 inch posters, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I got 10 pieces of this one by two, eight foot long wood. Each one of these cost me a dollar and 18 cents. I can't argue with that. So of course you're gonna need some nails, um, a saw, unless you got a power saw. I have one, but I just wanted to show, if you don't have any type of power tools and you just have like the basics, I just wanted to show you that. So I got this hand saw with my, my, my cutting block, a hammer. I got some nice finishing nails and the tape which is inside. And I'll show you um, pretty much how I lay everything out. 
So what I want you to do is just stay tuned. I'm gonna show you my step-by-step -step procedures and you can have something. All right, you guys, right. so my first step was I got my first piece of one of my two, I guess we would call it fern strip, if you will, um, piece of wood, and I measured the long side of the poster. The long side of the poster was 40 inches. So I took my tape measure, measured from this far in here to 40 inches. I made a mark, let's see if you can check it out. All right, you see the mark down there, close to my blade, right, right there. So I made a mark, 40 inches. So what I'm gonna do is, since I'm doing one poster at a time, I mean, you can cut them all at one time or you can just go do it poster by poster. So what I'm doing is, I'm going by poster by poster so I can pretty much demonstrate how I do it. So I'm gonna cut two of these, 40 inches, and I'm gonna take another one of these boards and they're gonna be roughly 27 inches long. So I can probably get two, maybe three pieces out of each strip going 27 inches. I think three inches, I'm, I think three pieces. But 27 inches, I'm gonna cut two of these out. One hour later. exact same distance or the, the exact same dimensions as my posters. So what I'm gonna do is, let me reach over here. I know it's a bit awkward, but this is how I did it. I'm gonna take this, I'm going to, with some nails, of course I'm gonna get it straight in position right, but I'm gonna nail, nail this in on the back end. Now let me put four screw, uh, four nails or four screws, whatever, whatever your preference is. And then I'm gonna also go. This is one of the straps. But I'm gonna do the same thing with the bottom end here. And on the inside, my shorter pieces, my 27 inch pieces, should fit right in here. So that's gonna go ahead and make the base for my box. So. I'm gonna fast forward this video, so just check me out. Next up, I can use either this side or that side to put the hinges, depending on pretty much the preference. Like if you want them on the left side, you want them on the right side, uh, pretty much is up to you. So what I do is I attach my hinges to my frame first. Well, I'm sorry, to my poster, and then I attach it to my frame. All right, guys, better view here. So what I did do, went inside, got this aluminum tape here. So if you can check this out here, this is pretty much without any
Hey guys, so I want to thank each and every one of you for checking out my video. Hopefully it was something you could take away from this video. You know, I'm not a DIY guy. All right, I'm kind of handy. All right, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of handy. But this video here, this is like a step-by-step -step process and it takes exactly what you need to know, exactly what you need in order to make a movie poster LED light box frame. And it's a lot cheaper than anything on the internet. You know why? Because you made it. You made it. You did that yourself. Yeah, you. You did that. I ain't do it. I just gave you the tools and the skills to do it. But you did it yourself. So go ahead and subscribe to this video. Share your thoughts and comments below. And we'll see you on the next one.